Christopher? Where's Christopher? Just he's went. in there. I want a ban. Dan, he's not allowed to drink. Nice yeah. bag and he's broken. Gas. Ah. <laughs> do the way, do the way. Look at us, sir. Look at us. Oh, man. <laughs> Ashley! Fucking old in there, isn't there? Yeah, man. With me, I've got the new WBA interim champion, Derry Matthews. First and foremost, congratulations on a great win, Derry. And uh, how, how thrilled are you to finally get your hands on one of these belts? I'm over the moon, listen. It's been, it's been a hell of a journey the last couple of days. It's been hard. You know, I don't know who I was fighting, one minute of fighting, fighting the uh, Southpaw, one minute of... Women are fighting a southpaw, women are fighting a tricky opponent in Abel. And all of a sudden, I'm fighting a come forward fighter who, who does not stop coming forward. And listen, he was a hell of a fighter, good fighter. I've just been in the changing room to see him. And I wish him well, and, and I'm guaranteed that we'll almost obviously see him on the boxing circuit again because he's you always know, a tough customer. And I'd like to see him with a few, few of the Brits in, in Britain. I mean, you've been a great servant to boxing, you've been in boxing for most part of your life. Said, how does it feel to finally get to the pinnacle? I'm only 22, you know, James. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, listen, it's been a, it's been a journey. It's been a roller coaster. We've had some ups and downs, but you know, I've worked my bollocks off in the gym, and the people in MGM will, will tell you the stuff Taff's doing with me, the stuff Danny's doing with me, getting up at six o'clock in the morning for the track. Joe Selkirk handing me clothes and stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> it's, been, it's been hard, but listen, it's been enjoyable. I've loved every minute of it, and now we just want to rest. It's about resting with my little man and my family and my wife, and, and, you know, and then planning what's, the, what's next for me. I know you must have dreamt about this moment for many, many years. Did you ever think you would, you would eventually get there, Derry? Yeah, I, I always believed in, me, believed in myself, and I always believed I had the ability. I come from the best amateur boxing club in my eyes in the world, the Solly, and... You know, it was just about getting the right people to get the best out of me, and I believe I've got that now. I believe I'm in the best position. I believe that Danny, in my eyes, is the best boxing coach in the world. It's like, you know, certain fighters gel with certain people, and the first day I went to MGM, I teamed up with Taff. I'd known him 15 minutes, and I went backstage to Danny and said, listen, this, 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 this works for me, this works right away, and, and you know, that's what, that's what a good team's about. It's about talking, to, talking with the team. The team know when I'm tired and tired and know when to push me. And, and to, tonight I had to dig deep. And I had Danny in the corner giving me great instructions. And, and I've worked and, and I've won a nice belt. I mean, Tony Louise, how much credit do you give to him? And how, do you think he's the best opponent you've been in with so far? Yeah, um, yeah I'd say so. That. Have some scissors, please. Um, I'd say, oh, yeah, I would say so. And, you know, listen, I'm in a position now that every British fighter wants to be in. I'm mandatory for the world champ title. I'm, I'm, as far as I'm concerned, I am a world champion. They've got to fight me. If they don't fight me, give me the belt. Just not, you know, they're keeping it warm for me. Keep, give me the belt. And you know, Kevin Mitchell's got a world title fight. I wish him all the luck in the world. I hope Andy Crawler comes back. And you know, as I stated before in the interview outside, me and him could have a great comeback. And a few quid, shout out to Big Amina. And, and you know, there's many more fights out there. But at the moment, I'm in the best position any lightweight in Britain wants to be. I mean, Perez has now been elevated to full champion. Will you look for the Perez fight? Because now you've got a belt, that surely that makes some of the, the British fights and domestic fights defences yeah, could potentially be even bigger. Well, listen, do I need to fight them? You know, do I need to fight per, um, anyone in Britain? The way different promotional team and it's about me looking after myself now. It's about who Danny wants me to fight, who Daniel, Daniel King, and my manager, the two he wants me to fight. And, Listen, I'll fight anyone. I'm a fighter. I'm a fighting man. What do you want to do? Who do you want to fight? Um, I want to fight the best. I want to fight Richard Abel tonight. I want to fight the best. I'm here to fight the best. I walked in the gym at eight years of age, wanting to fight the best. I sparred the best all my career. And, you know, it's about fighting the best. But financial-wise, I think me and Andy Crawler is a massive, massive fight. He and all Manchester. I think it sells out both arenas. And, you know, and Andy's a great fighter. Um, but... You know, it's, it's, it's one of them things. If, if promote, both promoters can come together and work on it, it'll be a cracking fight for both of us. MGM's first world champion, Derry Matthews. I was MGM's first British champion as well, so I've got a habit of winning titles for them. Uh, but listen, without them, I wouldn't be sitting here and I would a new belt. Everyone out, out there, the team, from the staff in the gym, the customers in the gym, you know, it's, it's, they're all world class. They're all, you know, help me in every way. And 
you know, the journey. As far as I'm concerned, that was a semi final tonight. Now I'm in, now I'm in the final, now I'm in the big league. Now it's about getting a few quid for my family. Um, you know, being, being secure, looking after my little man, uh, my wife, and, and, you know, and enjoying the good time. I'm one of three world champions from this city. Me, Paul Longerton, and John Conti. You know, to, and it's like, we're from a great fighting city, but I'm one of three, and I'm over the moon with that. Terry Matthews, congratulations on a fantastic win. It's great to see you achieve your dream. Uh, appreciate you talking to our Thank TV. you very much. Thank you. Come on! Can I have some scissors?